while you drop a soap no yes sir oh. do you feel kind of warm yes sir now that is also some amount of heat has been produced that is also kind of chemical reaction and those kind of reaction calorie meter is also used mm -hmm. in those kind of okay usually used in those kind of situation yeah. where it can measure the amount of heat produced during the reaction okay Yes, sir. Okay, so everyone has joined. Yes, sir. Seven different. How many people has joined? Only nine people have joined. Eight. Eight. In okay. Six left. Six left. Seven. So I'll be taking the attendance now. Seven left. <laughs> so try to remain in the class. Don't exit in between. So I'll take attendance in between. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. So in calorie meter, what we were doing previously? Anyone? I think is it clear? No, I think calorie meter. I think it's is clear to everyone. Big is just a device used for measuring what amount of heat produced. You know, I think that's clear with everyone. Now today, what we are going to do is next is what what we are going to do specific heat of liquid. Okay. Of liquid. Usually specific heat. What what was your specific heat? What was the specific heat? Previously, I think we have done amount of energy needed to okay. increase yeah. the heat of the body by one degree Celsius. The heat of a unit mass, no? Unit mass, unit. Yeah, that of whole body is thermal capacity, no? Capacity. Okay. So okay, uh, today we are going to do what specific heat of a liquid. Of a liquid. Suppose we have a calorimeter. Okay. So this is a calorimeter, just like a bowl and the water. No, previously, if you put a thermometer over there, that will be what your calorimeter. Everyone can see this? Yes, sir. So this is the calorie meter, this whole setup. Here what you will put? A thermometer. Now there are two thermometers here. One thermometer, another thermometer. Apart from this, what you will have? Previously we have done? Glass rod. Huh? Glass rod. Glass rod. Steering. Storer. No. In that ring. Storer. You'll have one storer. That kuniki ring. Insulating. Insulating ring. There will be something like this. Yes. Yes, sir. From the outside. From the outside, like this, no? Yes, this sir. will insulate it from the this one, like this. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And that covering. And the lid has been covered like this. Is the diagram clear? Yes, sir. Water will also be there. 
What will also be there? Inside there will be liquid, no? Actually. Yes, sir. Inside. Inside, let's say there is water over here. This is called A. And let's call this in over here we have what? Water. Water. And in the other, what do we have? Over here, what do we have? Let's say we have liquid, some liquid, we don't know, some liquid. Okay. This is yes, where you have liquid. Is the diagram clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is at your what? Constant temperature. Constant temperature. And thermometer is giving you reading T1 and T2. Is it clear till here? Just a diagram. Yes, yes, sir. And over here, what do you have? Space. Air space. Air space or something <clears throat> water will keep your constant temperature. Air or something actually it doesn't matter. So it will keep a temperature at P3. Is it clear? Yes, now which sir. is surrounding and which is source? Can you tell me? Which one is surrounding and which is source? T2 is surrounding. No, no, no. T3 is surrounding. It's surrounding. T3. Okay, and T1 and T2 are the sources. Yes. Yeah. Which yes, is at a same. Which is at a, which is placed inside this system. Clear. I think it's clear till here, no? Just like in a bowl, you have a water. Clear. Yeah. There you put yes, sir. two liquid to cool. One is water, let's say, and another is milk. Milk. Oh, okay, very good. Yes, sir. Okay. Is the diagram clear? <clears throat> Yes sir. yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Actually, we know. Actually, what we know, what will be the amount of heat over here? By the Newton's law, we know, no? D, dt by t naught. T minus t naught. D, t by d t. K this. Is minus of K by MC T minus T naught. It was this, no? Yes, sir. Negative sign was there somewhere. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. K in front of minus K by minus K. It was something like this, no? Now, can we do the same thing for both water and liquid? Two times. Yes, sir. Okay, actually the water is at a different temperature and your liquid is at a different temperature. So your water is at what temperature for A? Temperature is 51. No. And the material was, it was water. Water. And the surrounding temperature was? T3. T0 was T3. Clear? Yes. And similarly for B, what was yes, the case? This use a different color. I think this color is quite hard to see, no? Yes, sir. No, is it okay? This color? Can you see it clearly? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What was the temperature of B? T2. T2. It was some liquid we don't know. Now, what is the whole purpose of this? T3. T3. So why we are putting to this, what we are finding? Temperature. No, 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 at the initially I have said specific fake yeah. heat of what? Yeah. Yeah. Heat of what? Liquid. So what we are doing in this experiment? We are finding yeah. what? In the heat. Specific what? heat of liquid. Specific Basically heat. we are finding the specific heat of a liquid. For water, we always use the specific heat to be what? C of water to be all this one. Clear? C of liquid, yes, we don't know. Let's put it C, okay? Yes, sir. I think it's clear here, no? Yes, so sir. now we keep on putting into this formula. Clear? <clears throat> now for A, what we have? 
integration of dt by dt t minus t was what t1 t1 no? t1 okay is equals to negative a t1 minus t3 t3 no should i put it t what or t3 no Okay, three. Is equal to how much? Minus Negative three. capital K by MC. Yes. I'll differentiate capital K by this. Okay. Yes, yes sir. sir. So it will be easier for you. K divided by that will do it later. <laughs> I'll write something different over here. It was MC. MC. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But I have added double. Can you see? Yes, sir. So why I have it added double? What was double? Do you know? Do you remember double? Previously, we have done. Previously, what we have done? Specific heat, thermal capacity, and EQ. yeah, Rita was correct. What was that, Rita? Water equivalent or something? Do you remember? Water equivalent. Do you remember? A hey, yes, sir. So actually, why we have added that? Do you know? Do you have any idea? One question, okay. Both this calorie meters are same. Both of this A and B calorie meter are same. Okay. Same calorie meter. That means they are made up of what? Same material. Look, apart from the mass of water, it will also have something from this, no sir? It from this material. This will also absorb or heat. absorb some heat, or it will give some heat. No, actually, do you understand yes, the problem? This was a calorie meter. Okay, inside you have water. What was the mass of the water? Mass of the water was m. Clear? Yes, sir. But apart from that, do you have something outside? Which is holding this water? Yes, sir. I'm asking to everyone. Is this point clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <clears throat> but the there will be specific heat of water will be different from the material which the calorimeter is made out of. Is that point clear? No, sir. I'll tell you once one more thing. Do you agree on one thing that apart from water, we just Containing that water also has some mass. Yes, sir. Is that point clear? Is that point clear to everyone, Rita? Yes, sir. But these two are different material. A water and this material, which is made out, are they two kind of different materials? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes. So the water will have its own specific heat, and this material will also have its own specific heat. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is this point clear? Yes sir. Yes sir. So you cannot directly add these two masses. So what we do? We put W, which is your what? Water equivalence. Equivalent. So it will take in account for your mass as well as a specific heat capacity. Because how it was defined? M into C. No. Do you remember? Yes sir. Yes sir. So that's why. Clear? No. Yes, sir. Is this point clear or not? Clear. Clear, sir. Let's put it this. MCW, water is for water. No. Plus, due to this material, again, additional MC will come, no? Due to the material. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So that's why we are adding this too. Now, is it clear this point? Yes, sir. No, I think it must be crystal clear, no? Or not clear? 
I can explain it one more time. Yeah. I can explain it one more time if you have any doubts. Anyone has any doubt? <clears throat> Sultim has. No sir. Deepika. No sir. Abib. No sir. Abib is not here. Any doubt, Abib? No sir, it's clear. It's clear. No, so I will continue. Is it fine? Yes, sir. Okay. <clears throat> So we know that the C of water is what? We can take the specific heat of water as 1. So this equation will turn into what? dt by t minus t3 negative k by m plus w into integration of C plus okay. I think it's clear. Now the temperature has reached. Uh, should we choose any number? For the water, let's say initially the uh, water was at 60 degrees Celsius. Now it has reached to what? At time is equals to zero, or let's say any time zero, and at time t1. Initially it was at 60 degree and it went to 55 degree okay so this is the time which is needed for water to reach from this is roughly i'm just taking okay so we will have the integrating constant so just to get rid of that clear yeah. yes sir so the integration will go from 60 to 55 no it's fixed sir huh Why MC by MC plus. Anyone has a question? Just ask me. No, tell me. What was the question? If this one should be T1. Sorry, this one should be T1. Okay. This is for T1. Now tell me. Was there any doubt? Why use 60 and 55 that you are asking? Deepika, you are asking something, no? Yes, sir. Actually, we are just assuming that uh, initially the water was at temperature 60. You can take any number. Let's say that it was at 100 degrees Celsius. And after some time, yes, it went to 80 degrees Celsius. Clear? Initially, yes, at, and it took T1 time. So that's why we are just roughly using this. OK, so we are just assuming this. Is this point clear? Yes, sir. Or should we do without this? Either way, it's fine. I think we can go with this one. No, I think it's clear. Yes, sir. This one was for A. So similarly for B, what we can do, the time taken for the liquid, I think it will be different, no? Is this thing clear? Is this point clear? I'm asking to everyone. Deepika, is this clear? So again, MC. M is the mass of the liquid. C is the specific heat of the liquid. OK? Yes, sir. Mass of liquid. Because both are same calorie meter, no? So this top loop will be same for both. Because both are made out of same material. Clear? C is specific heat of liquid. And W is what here? Water equivalent. T1A. Now should I explain this one more time? Yes, sir. Okay. Still here is it clear for A? 
yes sir or should i continue or should i repeat for a no sir till a is fine no yes sir so for b what was the thing for b sir. mass of the liquid was m so what was the specific heat c and what was the work function or the work water equivalent of the material it was what w now you can ask me one question why this water equivalent is same for both is that your question as both the calorie meter no this is the calorie meter is made out of same material same they are identically same so that's why the water equivalent will also be same now is this point clear yes sir yes sir i think it's clear till here no yes. so we use it will be d by temperature is t2 t2 minus surrounding temperature was what air t3 t2. clear is equals to negative k divided by m into c specific heat of the liquid plus what you do you add the water equivalent into integration of dt now is it clear till here yes sir yes sir what, just like in the previous what we have done here previously c was what c was 1 for the water so it just became m plus w clear clear yes sir sir so it will go from 60 to 55 same but the liquid and water they cool cools at a different temperature at a different time isn't it yes sir so that's why what you do is this will again will be 60 to 55 let the time taken for this to becomes what t2 okay t2 is a time taken for liquid to reach from what to what 62 55 55 clear yeah. yes sir this is another equation now can we compare the equation of water and for the liquid can we compare this two are this two equation exact this two a and b there is a difference of can you see t2 is here and instead you have t1 here yes, that is the only difference no but yes, the sir. both are this t1 and t2 is equal because it's starting from 60 to 55 so it will be same no is my point clear yes sir yes sir because both are starting from 60 and ending at 55 so both this t1 and t2 should be same at a given that time clear yeah. abhi clear yes sir yes sir so equating 1 and 2 what you will get equating 1 and 2 what do you will get is it clear till here this two will cancel out is it clear equating 1 and 2 left hand side is same so we are just equating the right hand side is this point clear or not clear sir so finally what you will get Negative will also I think cancel out. They say less it will put it positive. So T one divided by T two will be equal to what? M plus W divided by M C plus W. So what you are finding? What you are finding? 
what was the whole idea of doing this what we were finding mm. yeah deepika continue specific heat of the liquid we were okay, finding we want to find which is given over here can you see yes sir so we will bring it on this side m plus w mc you can write as t2 by t1 m plus w minus w no w or c can be written as t2 divided by t1 m plus m minus w by m now is it clear this is the specificate of a liquid clear yes sir now even if the mass of the liquid and the mass of the water was different then still this holds okay T two divided by T one, it will have M plus W divided by capital M. This is mass of the of the what of the liquid. So this is the final expression. Clear? Yes, sir. I think it's clear till here, no? Yes, sir. I I. Do you have any doubt till here? Do you have any doubt till here? I'm taking the attendance now. Rule number one was also here, so only got your card. He was here. Yes, sir. Rule number one. Okay. Who is rule number one? Who is rule number on one? Unknown. Unknown. Yeah, unknown. Are we just clear till there? I think it must be clear till now, no? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Clear. Yes,